Hey guys, Brito here. Welcome back to Sim Casino. Here we are for a another episode where I've actually gone over here and got this sort of started ready for us to bring in the um, office workers um, for during during the day. I don't know if we need an extra door here or not. I don't want to because I want them coming in out of the front main door, I guess. Because people have been actually walking down in here and then back out again, like the gamblers and stuff, which is really weird, but... Um, going over how we went yesterday, um, 36,000 income, the vault collection, uh, where's our gambling, yesterday we made 43,000 off slot machines, so I think we really should have our next focus be um, a high roller slot machine area, um, even down here I think I want to expand down here, open this up a little bit to match with this. Put some machines on this side and then some machines on this side to have like a little gambling room down there as well. But I've got it paused at the moment because I want to get this all done first with our uh, business services. So what my plan was is to bring in the computer desk. Uh, we just want like a normal computer chair. It doesn't really matter. So straight there on all of these turn around the other way same thing uh, these rooms are a little bit different to these ones because I had them as 4x5 so 4 wide 5 long but then we couldn't fit in um, the conference tables down here so I've had to change that a little bit let's throw in uh, the printers beautiful alright printers along this wall which is great then our conference table, which will only fit in one spot really. So they are quite big, as you can see. Right, we'll throw that one in there as well. So that's two conference rooms and six computer rooms. These conference tables are huge. Um, I don't know if we can possibly have, you know, a conference room with four of these or three or four of these tables. For more than just eight people these only take four of course uh, and these take eight as you can see these guys are only the four but i love the description um, to be placed in meeting, meeting rooms where business customers argue over bad decisions capacity four capacity eight all right so let's um put the speed back on again i did paint these walls but obviously i've had to move those walls so i have to repaint them uh yep I just went with, you know, basic, holy dooly, basic stuff in there. Now that is crazy. What are all these people? They're all business customers. They're all uh, business customer. Business. So where are they going? Are they leaving now? Because uh, no, they're all going to sit here and drink. I think business. Yep, he's drinking. Good. Uh, what are you? Gambler? Gambler? Uh, business customer? I wonder if they're going to go and drink as well. Right, so business customer. I don't know how we make income out of this. Don't know if I need... Oh, so he's come in. She's on the computer and he's come in to use the printer. Well, that's interesting. They're in here yelling at each other, doing their thing. Um... Sleep and hunger. So I don't know. Down here it's quite plain. So let's have a look at um, putting in some chairs. 400 bucks for these chairs. And they're not too bad. Let's put a couple there. Don't know. I don't know if I want to put them there as well. Because obviously it's um, quite restricting. Alright, put that one there, and another one there. I'll just give them somewhere to sit out the front there. Um, let's have a look at some pot plants. Throw one in there. Auto saving. Just to try and pretty the place up a little bit, I guess. I don't know what she was doing. She was doing like a 360 thing then. Holy dooly, look at them all coming in. Bingo. Business customers. 
literally got people everywhere at the moment. Definitely going to look at this room now as our next build. Um, grab our wall removal tool so we can remove that wall there and this wall here. Uh, not that wall. Wish we could go control Z and then put it back and get our money back. Like that. Dismantle. Dismantle. We can go with our clone tool which will give us this floor. Like that. Uh, clone. No, not you. Clone that wall. There we go. And I don't want to make the room... I don't want to put any windows in that room. I think I want to make them... Or we'll leave them like that. Because... If they don't know what... If it's light outside, then they'll just keep playing. That's sort of my theory anyway. Right, so let's have a look. Um, infrastructure... Where is our, our business? There we go. The conference room, printing station, computer desk. I mean, so it's going to be a little bit of income. It's not going to be massive amounts, but not only is it going to bring people in here to use the computers and stuff, like, I think they're going to come over here. So he's an entertainee customer, entertainee, business customer. So they're still going to stay here and play, which is good. Definitely good. Um, I want to look at what happened then. Did I do that? Maybe I haven't painted that yet. There we go. So slot machine, XRE. Do we have um, XRE? So that you can choose different ones there too. I don't know what the difference is. I think it's just what they look like. What really? I don't think it really matters. These ones probably look the best. Uh, it just says Goldfinder. But I don't know if I can actually... Oh yeah, we can. We can change the different games on there, so that'll be alright. Um, the Goldfinder. If we run them all down here, how much is that going to be? 20,000? Uh, I think we will. Let's just try and... Is that the same chairs? No, it's not the same chairs. I think we'll go with these ones. We'll paint them. That's the bottom, and we'll put the chair as a black. Right, let's throw that in. There. Right, now I want to slow it down because... I want to go play cost again. $10. Uh, yeah, we'll go apply it all in the row. So we'll start here and we'll go. Actually, we'll start here. Go that one. Elven Forest. Lucky Mill. Queen of the Sands. I know some aren't as popular as the other ones. Uh, Zombie Treasures. Yep, that's fine. Which ones are the most popular? Lucky Mill. And. And the Zombie one, I think. Lucky Mill and Queen of the Sands. So let's go here and we'll go uh, Lucky Mill. Queen of the Sands. There we go. Get those going. I know that's quite a bit of money we've just thrown out there, but... No, I want to clone the light. There we go. Right there and there. So hopefully these ones will start to bring in a decent amount of cash as well. And then we'll end up being bloody rich. Which would be great. I mean, want maybe in here like a high roller gambling room for the slots. Um, how are we going with storage, betting tickets, coins and notes? Yeah, four should be right. Sodas, we want two. Pay out. Let's go 30 of those. Actually, maybe 20. We don't want to go too high. Uh, decks of cards, snacks, wine bottles. Yeah, that should be okay. As I said, I'm hoping these go really well. Then we'll put some more on this side, I think. 
Um, let's try and make this room look a little bit nicer. Throw away some pictures. Doom and gloom picture there, I guess. One of these over. Brainless picture, there we go. Now, I don't know. No, we might just throw the bins in the corners like this again. I think that'll be alright. I don't think we can get. Oops, not you, but that. Oh, we can put it in front of the painting. That's pretty good then. Black pot plant. Black. Let's go with a um, dark red. Dark red plant. Beautiful. That'll make that room look a lot nicer. So conference rooms. I think they've gone okay. We'll have to have a look and see. Business. So what's that? 100... 50, 450, 500 bucks maybe. So not too bad. Our slot machine comes 40,000 at the moment. Hopefully that's only going to get better. All right, we've got 17 grand back in our account. So these games are all shut because there's not many people here at the moment. So I'm going to leave those all the same, all the Ring of Fortunes. So we can't actually change that game. Is there any more of these that we can't change the games on? Uh, game Jack, we can't. Uh, okay, so Game Jack is the other one. So we'll put some more of those, put some Game Jacks in over here as well, I think. Alright, where are we? Where's the Game Jack? There it is. Right, so we want to go like that. I think I went dark brown and then black. So Game Jack could go there and there. This one can go down to $10. This one can go down to $10. And then we'll fill up the middle eventually when we get a little bit more money in the bank. Right, so these guys are all still not here. This guy's still not here, which is good. So we're saving a little bit of money that way as well. Is it... Where are we? I limit 18,000 we need, so that'll be one of our next things. I'll have to keep an eye on how these go. It's a Tuesday, so it's not obviously not a busy day, but we had 598 visitors today, which is good. Everyone was satisfied. Uh, boost, none, none, none. So business there. Casino ratings 95%. What are you up to now? 317,000 is our value, which is really good. But these ones are getting played, those machines as well. Um, I've just noticed we have a um, couple of empty spots. Let's go with an orange, like a dark green as well. A uh, couple of empty spots, we don't want those being empty. Right, the toilets, extra little area there. Here comes a lot of business people. So I think they're all business people. Yep, looks like it. They've all charged in to do their thing. I don't know if we can actually charge any more for that sort of thing. That's obviously gambling. Entertainment, bingo hall. Um, no, there's nothing in there about charging. Recent crimes, uh, none. Maintenance start at midnight. Let's go for eight hours. Research. So there's nothing in there to see how much we charge. Still can't afford to pay that. No. See how much we charge these guys. Click on that. It's just to disable it or dismantle it. There's nothing as far as um, changing how much we charge and stuff. 
Hope you come some more people. It's like a lot of business customers. Obviously, that's what they're here for during the week, Monday to Friday, and it's actually a Tuesday in summer. So I think every seven days or every week is a cycle as far as the, the seasons go as well. Right, so that bar's a little bit busy. 9am. This one should be opening soon. I thought they were meant to be open at 9am. Uh, where's our pit boss? Our pit boss isn't here yet either. Everyone's up here, wait. 10 a.m. Here comes everybody. Right, where's all of our... Here they come. Better late than ever, eh? Yep, they're all coming in. Looks like they're coming in very late. Right, let's check on our um, 10,000 of the slot machines. The business is doing all right again. If not... I said not overly great, considering how much we've paid for it, but in the long run, this is going to be free money, pretty much. Like, we're just going to have to repair things, but we're not going to have to do anything else. It's like $6 an hour or something they charge. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, conference table doesn't give us an income. Oh, so we can rename the conference room. Oh, interesting. All right, so what do we got? 212 people at the moment, 31,000 in our vault. This room's getting a little bit busy again. Uh, I think there was... Oh, here. Yeah. Offer a free snack and drink from a server if a loss of at least $10. Free holds hotel room, free buffet, free... We'll offer gift vouchers. Free snack or a drink if they lose. Let's say if they lose more than 50 bucks. Uh, let's make it 100. If you lose 100 bucks, you get a free drink. I don't know if that's going to hurt us or help us. Look at all these green. $6 from a computer desk. So I wonder if it comes up with like printer or something. We're making a lot of money at our drinks bar. Bank reimbursement, bingo income, computer desk six dollars. Business fifty dollars, two transactions, so that must be twenty five dollars for um, conference rooms, maybe. Which isn't too bad. Maximum staff expenses, 13,000 property tax. All right, interesting. But 33 grand sitting in the vault. Um, I think at midnight it takes it out and it leaves behind whatever's in there up to 20,000. So 38,000 in slot machines today. What was yesterday? 40,000. So definitely going to be ahead today, I think. Yep, we're already at 40,000. Still got plenty of time to go. So this is definitely going to help us increase our money. These guys are all at dollar machines, I think. No, 25 cents. We can actually eventually put in some 25 cent machines, some dollar machines, some five dollar machines, ten dollar machines. Ooh, here comes a lot of people again. I wonder if they're... Ah, so the business workers seem to be gone now. I'm pretty sure they only come in until... Uh, so, so from 10 till 2. Hopefully they stay around and get drunk and spend some money. That'll be nice. So I wonder, so there's four or five people getting out of the taxis and then here comes a bus. Just blocking this guy off. There's five people get out of that car, four people out of that one. People rolling in everywhere. This is how we start to roll in the dough. So I think, yeah, we want like a high, I don't know if we put it over here. We've got plenty of room back here. It's kind of, I know the casino doesn't look too bad at the moment. 
but it's so hard to design something that actually looks good. I don't know, I'd like to see what um, you guys have done if you guys have got the game. Feel free to take a photo of your casino layout and send it through on uh, Discord. Link to Discord's in the description. Uh, put it in there in maybe the general chat area or something like that. If you guys want. Uh, four and a half, that's only got 5,000 in it. There's plenty of cash sitting over here we need picked up. Where's the security guards? Maybe we need another one. No, he's, he's flat out on his feet, the poor bugger. Yeah, I think we might need another security guard. Which wouldn't hurt, to be honest. Um, cash vault. Cashy cage is one. So cash vault. Let's go two of these guys. I think that's going to help because... Yeah, see, she's going to come in and get the cash and take it in the vault. And that'll help build this up. Having the one guy run around doing everything is probably not good. Although now they're both idle. Which is annoying because there's... Yeah, machine. Anything with more than a thousand dollars in it, they should really be going and getting it. Oh, there she goes. She's going to pick something up. Taking it up to the ATM. So I think we put our own money in the ATMs as well. That's why we keep getting... Um, you'll see pop up. There's like a bank transaction or a refund on bank transaction. Something along those lines, whatever it says. Bank reimbursement, there we go. So they'll, if someone takes out 150, the bank gives us 150. But then we've got to put our own money in to keep the cash in the ATM. That's definitely how it works. So, so it's nearly midnight during the week. I think all this will shut. Bit of a bummer. Or do we shut? No, I think we shut the whole side, don't we? The whole lot. Or just one side. Up oh, the whole lot. And our pit boss goes home as well. Yep, okay. So I wonder... Staff Hub, Cash Vault. Yeah, okay, Monday to Friday nights. We'll only have one. Night, Saturday and Sunday we'll have... One. Then daytime, Saturday and Sunday, we'll have two and two. Yep, I think that'll work out well for us. So we're at 32,000 now, so now we can throw in some more uh, machines over in here. Don't think we need any more of these Ring of Fortunes. So let's um, grab some more machines. I don't know, because on the other side we've got the... Um, Game ruler, don't we? Let's go with the fortune ruler. We want to change to those at black. Alright, now we want to go $10 machine, apply to all in row, go back through and go through them all like this. Elven forests, lucky mill, that's queen of the sands. Uh, what are you? Santa gifts, and then the zombie one. Good, so that's one of everything. That's going to help us quite a bit, so I don't know. I think I really should. I don't want bricks, I want the window. No, it's not letting me do it. Alright, go to here. There's our window. I don't think I can put one there. We've obviously got the painting on the wall. Uh, get that into there, there we go. Stairway. Alright, interesting. Definitely put some stairs in soon. I think we need like a food place too as one of our next... Our next big things. Um, what I'm going to do now actually is go... All the armoured truck now. There's 40 grand in there, so he'll give us a little bit more. There we go, which will allow us to get the high limit gaming, which takes 12 hours. So we can look at that for up here. I think a high limit, high limit pokey area up in here. Try and fill this whole room with high limit stuff. Right, so 
Let's have a look. What do we get? 46,000 in the vault collection. What do we have? Poke machine, 72,000. Um, we paid out 17,000 in receipts, so that's good. People are still winning. Um, and 5,000 in table game prizes. Uh, which hopefully we're still ahead in that as well. Right, so people are going to start flowing through now. Um, let's have a look at a local radio. Oh, I don't want to spend... I'll be happy to spend seven. Let's do that. Bring those guys in. Hopefully that's not going to bite us in the bum only having seven grand left, but... Look at these guys, they're all in here doing their businessy stuff. Looks like they're typing, not yelling at each other. It'd be good if they actually looked like they were yelling at each other or throwing things around, that'd be pretty funny. Right, so plenty of transactions coming through for the business, computer desks, the drinks, bars, getting a workout early on. Look at it go. It's a Wednesday and people, all they want to do is drink. A few guys that I feel like yeah they're up here waiting for these I think um, how'd that bingo go let's have a look and see how that went yesterday day 16 gambling bingo 390 um, and 480 so that's about 800 bucks 900 bucks that's not too bad I mean we really can't complain Eight or nine hundred dollars a day. Once it's once it's down, I know it did cost us quite a bit to put it down. So, uh, twenty six hundred, so thirty two hundred bucks. We've probably made that back already. This bingo hall. I don't know if it ever gets full though. So, it's one thing we'll need to try and keep an eye on. Still got some conferency stuff going on. Do we have... Yeah, we have a gap there. Let's come back into here. I think I want to throw in... Window. Lock by interior door, that's alright. Window, window, there we go. I know it does not the same as the rest of it, but... At least they've got some light in there. Normal light, not this artificial stuff. These wall lamps, which are... These ones are too high. I wasn't going to delete them and put them back down again. Just notice this wall needs to be redone. So does this one. Alright. Looking pretty good at the moment. How are these slot machines going? They're getting a workout as well. Have a look at today for gambling. Nearly 30,000 already on... Holy dooly! On bingo. Not bingo. Um, Poke machines. Bingo's looking a little bit busy. It's amazing how they sit down, stand up, sit down, stand up, and they just change. It's like they're playing. Oh, I was going to say Russian roulette, but no, not Russian roulette. Well, they, the one where they you got to sit down on the seat first. I can't remember what it's called now. You guys will tell me what it is. How are we going with table games? We're doing all right. There's people there. They're not full and lining up and waiting. This guy's just... I don't know what he's doing. Let's have a look and see. She's got five hours of repeat visits as a um, member. Seven hours as a club member. It's good to see people are coming back. They must love it enough to, to keep coming back. Um, 19 on the way. Boost of 98 because of our marketing, which is really good. Be better to have better marketing than that, but geez, that's another huge bus full of people. Definitely need some more pokies because these guys are getting smashed down here. These are the the 25 centers. I think next time if we do a casino, like next our next full build we do ourselves, I'm gonna make like a big entrance with just like a lot of pokies and stuff, all different values. So you know, from one cent all the way up to ten dollars. So it sort of caters for everybody then. Um, let's have a look and do a bit more outside stuff. How far over can I go? Oh, I can go all the way to there, that's good. And 
all the way up here, which is good as well. Go to there, yep, beautiful. And all the way to there, look at that. Lovely. Uh, where is it? I don't really want the palm tree. Because it doesn't look... It doesn't look great, but it doesn't look weird either. Alright, there we go, that'll do. Let's put those in down here. Let's look at our stone floors again. How big is that? The garbage area is there, so let's make that a little bit bigger. Delivery area, I can make that a bit bigger. Let's put some stones out the front too to make things look nice. At the moment, we're really rolling in the cash. 55,000 sit in the vault. Total of nearly 70,000 bet. We'll put through the these machines. Ah, uh, show me the tree. Press tab. I'll keep pressing shift. So 3,000. 3,000. A few of these have got a decent amount in there. It's going really well. Like, we're actually getting a lot of income now. We've paid 12,000 out in receipts on the uh, pokey machines, the slot machines, which is fine. Table games were paid out a little bit as well, but we should, well, I don't know if we're, yeah, we should still be ahead. That's three and a, uh, two and a half, uh, two and a half, four and a half, four and a half, so we're not really that far ahead, really. So I don't know what any of this means, blackjack. Three to two. Two to two. I don't know. I don't know what all this stuff is and what we should change it to. Should we get a commission if they get a blackjack? I don't know. Who knows? I don't really know much about that. I just know the pokies are our thing at the moment. Actually gives us a house advantage of 9.9%. One jackpot winner. 52 jackpot winners of 25 bucks. 56, 62, 59, 56. I wonder what it actually does when someone wins a jackpot. Like we could actually see them throw their hands up and get all excited or something. That would be pretty cool. Alright, I think we're ready to go like this and build this room. Um, I think I just want to... Let's get let's get, the, get it built, but not put anything in just yet. Uh, doors. Private locked door. I don't know if we want to... Double door or a single? I want a single door. Have it so it's like a um, smoker's zone or something like that. That. So they come in either end and then this whole room here. Uh, high limit. Come all the way down to there. Players club. So we can, I think we'll put like you know, ATMs in here and that as well. So what do these guys need? Bigger advantage for those. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll definitely get this done. I want to look at the flooring. I want to make it look really fancy in here. Black marble. Yeah, that wall. Oh, Jesus. I like the idea of having the black, but I'm not sure on that one or that one. That one's probably better. Um, on the walls... A themed wall. I, mean, I don't mind that, but it's really... It's probably more for a theatre than anything else. Uh, wallpapers. And that looks kind of fancy. Uh, bricks. I don't really want bricks in there. Paints. Oh, panels, there we go. 
Maybe the purple? Yeah, that looks a bit a bit bit more upmarket there, doesn't it? Certainly looks more upmarket. Um, where's our lights? I always forget where these are. Down here. Um, do like those as well. What's that? Is that the? That must be the, like the light. That's the light color, I think. Put a couple of these guys in. Um, demolish structures. That, I think that just got rid of that on that side, that's fine. We don't want to have um, those over there. Let's throw lights in there. Not really one we can place in the middle there. But I like these ceiling lights because they look kind of fancy. As I said, they're not really centralised. Let's go one there, one there, there we go. Alright, we'll keep it as a black, like a dark room again. But I think um, we'll end the episode here, guys. We've got 50,000 in the bank. Uh, what did we make yesterday off gambling? We made nearly 100,000 on slot machine income, which is crazy. Everything else is uh, pretty average, but the slot machines is where we're making our money. Everybody loves to play slot machines. I don't know why, because I hate it. But we're already up to like 16,000 today. Maybe because these aren't open early enough. I mean, I don't know, because people are coming up here, but I don't know if they're coming up to sit down or... Looks like she's sort of come up and she's just hanging around waiting. We shouldn't say what she was actually doing, like if she was waiting or... Yeah, but anyway, if you guys enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the series so far, if you got any ideas, suggestions, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet guys, please do so. It's been Brito, thanks for watching, see you again soon.